Um, hello, friends and viewers and subscribers. Um, this is a, um, a light fixture, and it's, it's just like a sconce, and it goes on the wall. And, um, you know, the light bulbs, they always collect a lot of um, bugs. So I wanted to collect a lot of bugs over time in order to show you just how many lives um, are at risk once they are born. Now, I know most of you um, do not place a lot of value on insects and insects' lives. And many insects do not live past, you know, a few hours or even a couple of days or a couple of weeks. And their primary goal or their purpose is to reproduce and then die. And, you know, that's just about what humanity does as well. They, um, they mature, they reach puberty, and they reproduce and they die. Now, our lifespans are a little bit longer, but if you look at how many lives, and this is only one light fixture in the house, and there are thousands and millions and billions of light fixtures around the world, globally, um, that collect lights. And this is just a demonstration on uh, just how many lives are lost because of reproduction. Now, you can look at these little insects, these little critters, as people also. In any given area, there are hundreds and thousands of deaths per day of people. And each and every one of these sentient beings suffered at some point during their life. And certainly, most likely, at the end of their life. So, we have a myriad of bugs here. Um, you know, all kinds of little flies. And um, there was a moth. Let me see. Right here. There is a moth, pretty good sized moth. And I save these pretty, um, these are like really pretty. These, let's put those on the car here. But these have an iridescent um, color to their, um, to their body. And um, yeah, so we have a huge variety of animal lives that um, were born and that suffered and that died, all because of um, their placement into existence. And animals and insects will probably always reproduce. <laughs> They're certainly not spaying and neutering for little flies, insects, and moss. But anyway, so uh, this little video was um, um, just to pinpoint um, how many lives are lost, regardless if it's human lives, animal lives, insects, insect lives, um, etc. Because they were placed into existence, they will end up suffering, aging, and dying. So thank you for watching my video, and please post a, video, um, a, a reply or a comment, and subscribe if you already haven't. Thank you.